Hey y'all, it's Austin here again, and uh, it's just gonna be a video of my farm toy collection. Uh, I guess I'll start off with trucks. Got this uh, Ford F250. I've had for a long time. I glued some 22 bullet shells in there to make uh, stacks and a bull bar on the front of a chicken wire. I've had this thing for a long, long time. Played with it when I was younger. Now I just collect them. Yeah, that's pretty much that. Uh, it's a herbal truck made in China. Jeep. Uh, next up for you, I got a uh, New Holland combine John Deere header on it. This header was originally a 12 row. That uh, you can see that there. I cut it down and re-glued it to make a eight row. And I plan on painting it yellow to match the New Holland combine because they're all the same looking. They're just uh, different lengths and colors. Yeah, and I'm gonna paint it yellow to match this New Holland older style combine. I'm not sure what model it is. I know a lot of that John Deere, not New Holland, but that's that. Uh, I've got this. This other John Deere combine, it's a 9860 STS kind. It's got the folding on it. Like, it, it folds that way and it folds the other way too. Like, it's supposed to. Uh, I've had this a long time too. I got another one just like it. This is the better of the two. This is in better shape. Uh, yeah, this one sits on my dresser. You just look at it. Um, had that for a little while. You know, stuff I've got. Another John Deere combine just like it. This one I don't happen to have the header on right now. The sticker's gone and paint's rubbing off in certain places. Basically the same combine. Uh, next I have is a Case International 2366 Actual Flow. My auger's broken. I lost both the headers. I've had this since I was in the first grade. And, uh, now I'm going to attempt. And, um, now on to the tractors. I've got, oh, before I get into the tractors, I forgot this. This is a, he's a dump truck that my mom stepped on and broke the bed, so I took it apart and I put that, put the bottom portion of the bed back on and made it like a flat bed truck. It's one of those uh, 50's GMC dump trucks. I like it. I play with that. I used to play with that one a lot. Uh, now on the tractors. My favorite. John Deere 2510 70's or 60's and 70's style tractor. I love this. I got it on birthday cake when I was little. I've always, always loved this one. Even though the paint's rubbing off and stuff, it's always been my favorite at all. Uh, and I've got older style enclosed cab. I think it's from the 80s. John Deere tractor. I'm not sure what, particularly sure what model this one is because it doesn't say on it. I know I've seen lots of these before in person on the farm. This is my uncle's farmer. I go over there a lot. Uh, next, we've got. And this John Deere tractor, which doesn't say the model either, and I don't know what model it is. <sighs> now we've got Case International MX220. This one's got singles on the front and duels on the back. This is like this is another one of my favorites. I've always loved this one. Had that a long, long time. Now, I've got John Deere Articulating Tractor that, uh, I'm not sure where I got this one. Oh no, it's one of the cheaper ones. It's kind of junky. It's like Dollar Tree or something. I don't think it's Ertl. You get it, it says Ertl on the bottom. Uh, but this is one of the cheaper ones. I used to play with that thing in the dirt all the time. And I've got, uh, now, Moving on to big tractor. Got this big John Deere 3140. 
This is, uh, I believe, 124th scale. The rest of them, I mostly put 160 to 160 some scale, 162 scale, I think. 164. Uh, this is. I know this one's a 124. Uh, I like it. I played a lot. Well, I brought it to school one time when I was in second grade. And broke the exhaust pipe off. So we got it of school. Did that. Uh, and I got a new Holland 8870 tractor. Uh, I don't know where I got this one or how long I've had it. This one's kind of just been shoved in the back for a long time. Not really a big collector of new Holland things. Oh, uh, get off. Um, this little tractor. Stickers are gone, and I don't remember the make and model. I know it's a John Deere, but I don't remember the model number it is. I know it's one of the smaller ones. And now I've got this little skid steer thing. Viral. I've had this since I was like a baby. It's always been one of my favorites. I like this one a, a lot. Um, yeah, I've had that one a very, very long time. Uh, now I'm just going to pull behind the trailers and stuff. Like I've got just a trailer for the F-350 or 250, whatever it is. It says 250 on it. Um, we got John Deere. Soul Saver, um, here, I, I like this one, I don't know where I got it or when, this one actually my cousin gave to me for my birthday, it's a little, uh, when I was in like fourth grade, it's a little, uh, drill planter, like beans and stuff, I don't have a corn planter, I'm looking for a corn planter, uh, well basically just, uh, here, John Deere wagons, grain wagons. Um, this one's actually for like a corn harvester, specifically a chopper. I uh, broke the chopper. I don't know where the chopper is up. Uh, I think I lost it. And I've got two John Deere auger trailers, identical. One's missing the sticker, the other one's not. Um, Yeah, you know, Case International, Baylor, 84, 65 Baylor, and I've got a little International hay rake here, and uh, International uh, mower. Um, A312. International mower. Uh, got this grain wagon. I don't know where it came from or how I got it, but I've had that one forever. And I've got last, not least, I've got a New Holland, the new, new Holland manure spreader. Uh, model number on this, I'm not sure. If this is rubbed off. My, yeah, model number got scraped off, so I don't know what it is. I'm sure. Find out. They only make like one of these manure spreader things. And yeah, I'm trying to get a. Um, it's not my new my collection is a a uh, corn planter mower. Looking for just a straight up disc and. Also, Case International Combine. That's one thing I don't have. Uh, one in good condition. Like I've got a Case International Combine here. This one's junky, but I'll, I'd like to have one that's good. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. See you later.